Hello everyone, so today we've got the uh, Curran um, waterproof leisure style fashion watch. Um, as you can see the packaging it comes with is as cheap as possible from China. Um, anyways, aside from the packaging, we have got the watch itself and surprisingly it's actually pretty nice. Um, now, although it said waterproof, uh, it is not waterproof and I know that because I've been using it for about a month and I had to dry it out once already because I did get some water in it um, But let, let's go over the watch itself. Uh, first off, it is quite large um, I don't have very big wrists, but as you can see it uh, It's a bigger watch um, It says in the description that it's military. I Don't really see military in it, but it is definitely a fashion watch the, the leather is all fairly high quality here. Uh, like I said, I've been using it for about a month. There is no visible wear. Um, I've noticed that the, uh, the uh, clock itself in it is neither fast nor slow. It is proper. It uh, follows properly. Um, the uh, day of the month uh, dial right there is accurate. Um, these three dials here inside are purely just aesthetic. They're just for looks. They don't do anything. Um, these two uh, side dials here are also just for looks. They don't do anything. This one that actually turns very nicely. It does not feel loose or anything. It turns very nicely. Pops out and then it can adjust the uh, time. Um, it, it feels very good quality that way and uh, it's uh, what you would expect. Um, let's put it on here and take a look. All right, so I've got the watch on now, and as you can see on a smaller wrist, it uh, it looks a little bit big, um, but realistically, it's it's a very nice fit. It's very comfortable, especially with this inner leather pad right here that they've added to it. It makes it so that. Your uh, arm hair never gets stuck in the back of the watch like I've had with many other watches and uh, you feel like it slightly pulls and whatnot. It's, it's not very comfortable, you get used. Um, as you can see, it's it's got nice styling here all around. There's a few loose stitches, but um, even if you pull on them, they, they don't start unraveling the watch. Um, so realistically, they could just be snipped off and you are good to go with it. So as you can see, the uh, the dial there is very nice, and I have put it through the test, like I said already, as getting it wet, it did leak, and they they actually, in the, the auction, they, they recommend that you do not get it wet, even though it claims to be waterproof. Don't take it in the shower or anything. Um, I also accidentally put it through more of a test where I was welding and got a little bit of splatter on the uh, uh, glass. Here, and this is actual glass. It's not cheap plastic, this is actual glass. Um, but the uh, weld splatter got a little bit stuck in it and uh, made it so it's a little rough. There's some uh, chips and whatnot in it and some melted points, but any watch would do that. So I really cannot say that that's because this is cheap. It, any watch would be affected by welding splatter. Um, the back side here, as we can see, try to get out. Um, how much of that you guys can really see um, it is actually a fairly nice back it says uh, water resistant on it, it says the uh, uh, company brand the uh, model made in China and yeah it's a uh, it's fairly nice looking back so Having said that, what you could do is take these little straps off. They, I believe they're just glued in place. You could take them off, take this whole back piece off, and wear it like a regular watch without this back piece. So you, you do have that option as well, and the back plate would look fairly nice. So at about $10, do I recommend this watch as a uh, fashion or military watch? As a military watch, definitely no. As a fashion watch, yes, it, it is quite nice. And... Um, Unless anybody's going to call you out on these things not working, which is highly unlikely, or these two dials here, um, is it's pretty nice. It's uh, quite aesthetically pe pleasing, and um, I, I think it is quite fashionable. 
Um, and the, uh, the quality seems fairly decent as long as you don't get it wet. I hope everybody enjoyed this video and thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later.